I'm in a secret location in Munich, Germany to show you this special cave. It is so bright in here, you guys. You wouldn't believe We're standing in the most sophisticated car scanner in the world. And I want to show you what it can do. This is so, so cool. Come with me. What can you do with a car scanner like this? You can bring trust back into a market that is known for a lot of fraud, used cars. You can take any decision based on the digital twin, no matter where you are, any time that you want. You can decide whether you want to buy a car, sell a car, insure it, finance it, repair it or move it from A to B. And all of this is possible because the quality of the digital twin is so high. So let's look at some of the really cool stuff behind this. As you drive the car in, it scans the, the floor of the car, right, underneath. And this is for the tires. You've got cameras here, you've got a big camera up here, you've got cameras over here, and you've got more cameras here in the door when that closes. Rim scratch. What I'm going to do is put these little things on and then we'll scan the car and see if it recognizes all of these little marks. And a little scratch. I actually have to walk out of the cave because it scans the paint on the car as well. And that needs really, really strong UV rays and it'd actually be dangerous for a human to be inside the cave. Let's start this process. How cool does that look? Close your up. You're gonna scan the car now, and then it'll take like five minutes, and then we'll have a look at all the things that it picks up. So we've just scanned the Senna GTR. There's like a 360 profile of this car. What it does is it creates a digital twin. So basically that is exactly that car in there, but it's a twin digitally. What it also does is it gives you beauty shots. So if you want to sell your car, you get your car like this in a studio with the, all the lights perfect, and then they can add a background here. Look, there's the first like attention marker, and that is where I placed the first bit of a tape. So if we just go into that, It'll show us the damage. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, now what about the black marker? Because the black marker is much more difficult to see. What else did it pick up on? Ah, got it. Got it. Ah, wow. okay. <laughs> that's cool. Check this out right here. It's going to show you that a body panel has been repainted. You see that? So that whole body panel and this one here, and that means you can start asking questions. Why has it been repainted? Look at this. How cool is that? See, look, it used to be a military vehicle, so you can actually see that it used to have a wrap. All this cool technology is very difficult to develop, as you can imagine. It's a very complicated measurement device. We started offering this only to selected early adopters in Europe, car manufacturers and car dealerships. But what excites us most is making this available to the general public. We want everybody to be able to drive to a shopping mall, parking lot or a gas station, press a button on the machine, wait for five minutes and get the digital twin with all the quality that you've seen. And then because the quality is so high, you can start safely transacting online. You can buy a car, sell a car, whatever you want online, just based on the digital twin. Other people are excited about the race towards autonomous driving. We're excited about the race towards autonomous vehicle valuation. Watch this space. <laughs>